Good morning. It's literally like 6 30 in the morning. A quick morning vlog. Quick naked morning vlog. If you want to see all X rated content under here, um, like Pornhub level status content, go to my Patreon link down below. This vlog is just like a little smorgasbord. It's a really short one. I just had a couple like random clips that I found from the past couple of weeks, and I was like, okay, let me make a vlog of it. Um, so you guys can see this footage. Um, so I hope you enjoy it. Um, I really don't know what this vlog is. I'm gonna try to vlog this weekend. I think I will. Maybe I can't guarantee. I'm going to try. Um, I try to vlog every weekend. Am I the best at it? Absolutely not. But do I try? Yes, I do. And that's what counts. So A for effort, F for like execution. I mean, Italy guy. We just went to Texas Roadhouse. We're walking out. Apparently, some other dog literally diarrhea on the fucking cement. He didn't know. We get in my car. I'm like, what is that smell? Sounds like fucking sewage. No, he's up driving the fucking dog diarrhea. No. I'm so mad. I'm gonna he's fucking so fucking mad right now. It's like really funny. Like, I don't blame him. Like, I would be like, if I see someone North walking Jerusalem with a fucking dog, I swear to fuck, if I see someone walking with a fucking dog, we're gonna pull over and I'm gonna, gonna eviscerate that motherfucker. I swear to God. Yeah, if you have a dog, fuck you. If you're watching this and you have a dog, fuck you. You're the reason. Fuck, like, I'm gonna blame on you, man. I can't. All we need is someone walking. All we need is someone walking. It's like this fucking idiot fucking... who's fucking parked the wrong way. Yeah, because he's got a dog. That's the guy. Literally, fuck you. fucking has a dog. Like, fuck everyone. Okay, so I'm supposed to be hanging out maybe with my friend Emily. She's gonna meet Italy guy. Me and Italy guy, we were out to dinner, and then Emily was telling me, like, this guy was basically ghosting her. So, I was like, why don't, like, we go out for dessert? You can meet Italy guy. I'm in TJ Maxx with him right now. And you guys know I love Diet Dr. Pepper. I love Dr. Pepper. They had Dr. Pepper lip balm. So, I, like, find it. I was like, oh my god, should I get this? Like, would you kiss me if I tasted and smelled like Dr. Pepper? And he's like, I already do. <laughs> and I was like, that's true. Like, he'll kiss me. Like, you taste like Dr. Pepper. Like, I know, because I only drink that. Um, but I thought it was funny and I wanted to vlog it so you guys can enjoy that little snippet. Um, I don't know what this vlog is going to be. I have a whole bunch of random footage with nothing to do with it. Oh, I found what I was looking for. So I'm going to go and maybe I'm going to go grab dessert with Emily and she's going to meet Italy guy tonight. That's going to be fun. What's up? I need an end clip to this vlog. I'm drinking my Diet Dr. Pepper. I'm wearing my Diet Dr. Pepper colored shirt. So, Italy guy, he did meet my friend Emily. Emily's like, oh, I like him. He's funny. I think he's so funny, Italy guy. Like, not to, like, toot my own horn that, like, I found a guy that I think is so fucking funny and has such a great sense of humor, but, like, fucking toot toot, like, oh, my God. <laughs> Ew, ick. I give myself the ick. But, um, my friend Stimmy gave his stamp of approval. Stimmy's girl gave her stamp of approval. Emily gave her stamp of approval. My mom so far is like, he's nice. So I guess that's her stamp of approval. My dad just doesn't talk. So like, whatever. So like, so far we're getting stamps of approval. But then I also think, okay, well, they also give other people stamps of approval who didn't deserve stamps of approval. So we're going to still watch ourselves a little. But needed an end clip for this vlog. And I had to update you that he did. Emily did meet him. We went to Carvel. We literally chilled in this Carvel for like, I don't know, almost two hours and just hanging out talking. May have found her a boyfriend who plays Pokemon Go, right? This is after the fact I'm recording this. We went to Carvel two weeks ago, okay? Um, yeah. His name was Dan. Very excited. I thought things with Dan were going to go great. Nope. Found out Dan smokes weed a lot. So like, that was a no-go. And Emily keeps getting ghosted left and right. Before dates, after, like before she even goes on the date, she'll get ghosted and unmatched. Or if she gets to a chance to actually go on the date... As soon as the date's over, she gets unmatched and ghosted. I don't know how. I swear to God, I go on dates with guys. They literally are in love with me. They fall in love with me on the first date. And they, like, want to see me again. So, I don't know why she has so much trouble, like, getting a date or getting a second date. And I'm not, like, that pretty. Like, I'm not that cool. Like, I think I'm a good conversationalist. Maybe that's where, like, I do good on dates. And, like, she just doesn't talk. But, like, we're trying to get her. I don't care if it's not winter anymore. It's cuffing season. We're going to try to get her a boyfriend. I have to burp. <coughs> um, so, like, Emily. Where's your boys at? Does anyone want to date my friend? She doesn't talk much. But it's fine. It's cuffing season. <laughs> 